The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the WWE Women's Championship. It is time for our first of five. Yes, five. I've been saying six all night long. Five championship matches here at the Royal Rumble. Nonetheless, the WWE Women's Championship is on the line here in Las Vegas. Representing the red brand, the number one contender, Liv Morgan, who last summer had a very short run with the Women's Championship herself and really has been trying to get back to this spot ever since. Liv Morgan went down with a undisclosed injury back in the fall, but burst on the scene once more last month on Raw. She has picked up victories over Tiffany Stratton and her alongside Natalia, picking up a huge tag team victory over Blair Davenport and the champion herself, Rhea Ripley, just a number of weeks ago. Liv looked in the eyes of the Eradicator this past Monday night on Raw sent a staring message that she was coming for the Women's Championship this Sunday. But can she get the job done here tonight when the lights are on bright and the gold's on the line? And that is an intimidating presence that is getting ready to make her way down the aisle. The Eradicator, the Nightmare, representing the Judgment Day and most importantly, the WWE Women's Champion, Rhea Ripley. As voted by you, the fans, the 2023 Women's Superstar of the Year. Ripley won Money in the Bank back in July, cashed it in successfully in September, and has steamrolled over the competition ever since. Picking up victories over Shayna Baszler upon that Money in the Bank cash-in. Going on to defend her title against Becky Lynch, once in Principality Stadium, the other in Madison Square Garden in an Extreme Rules match. And just last month at Armageddon, Rhea turning away one of the hottest newcomers to the red brand in Alba Fire. Now Liv Morgan looks to test her medal against the oh-so-dominating and intimidating champion. Rhea Ripley, word has it, going around the backstage area, that she's looking to make an example out of the number one contender here tonight. That is easier said than done. Liv Morgan willing to fight that uphill battle. She was able to obtain that very championship last year. Can she repeat history in 2024? Introducing the challenger from Elmwood Park, New Jersey, Liv And her opponent from Adelaide, Australia, she is the WWE Women's Champion, Rhea Ripley. Well, we talked about that tag team victory recently on Raw between Liv Morgan and Natalya taking down Blair Davenport and the Nightmare herself. Well, Rhea, Rip Rhea Ripley corrected that wrong just six nights ago with an emphatic victory over the Queen of Hearts. And if Rhea Ripley didn't send a message on that night, I don't know what will. Liv Morgan knows she's in for a fight. Rhea Ripley as dominant as ever. The bell has sounded and now is the time to succeed. The Women's Championship is on the line. Who is the better woman of Monday Night Raw? Rhea Ripley looking to bring her presence and absolutely dominate over Liv Morgan in the early going. Obviously, has got the strength and size advantage in this matchup. Liv Morgan's got a stick and move, in my personal opinion. Look at Rhea ever since the opening bell. Not even a minute ago, is all over the number one contender. Rhea Ripley has dominated a lot of the Raw Women's Division, whether it's been championship matches or non-title affairs over the last year. There is a reason she is on top of Monday nights. Can Liv Morgan be the kryptonite to Superwoman's championship reign? Liv taking a minute to create some distance on the outside. Rhea, however, well, sends her into the ropes. Liv, look at this. Big time DDT spiking her on the crown of her head. And now Liv Morgan, with the boots, Tilt to Whirl takes the champion down. 
Liv Morgan has got to do her best. Trying to stick, move, and keep down the champion. And cannot take her eye off the ball like she just did moments ago. Rhea Ripley is looking to make a statement tonight. The first live premiere event of 2024. The road to WrestleMania kicking off. Rhea looking to remind the entire women's division, not just on Raw, but in all of WWE, that there is only one queen of the queendom, and that is the Eradicator. Just absolutely women handling Liv over the top rope that time. There's also the test in this matchup as to what, whether Rhea Ripley is really taking Liv Morgan seriously or not. Liv's a former champion, but that did not last long. You gotta call it what it is. Liv was able to take down Asuka last May and become the women's champion four weeks later. Was tapped out by Shayna Baszler in the middle of Philadelphia. And Liv has been unable to obtain the championship once more ever since, so will tonight be the night? Or is Rhea Ripley just gonna con continue to have her way over the number one contender? Again, as we we're about to mention, Rhea Ripley cannot take the opponent lightly, however. She just sends her right to those diamond-plated steps. I'll tell you what, if this continues, this is going to be a historic win for Rhea Ripley. And she literally is steamrolling over the competition right now. Liv Morgan has got little to no offense in since the opening bell a few minutes ago. And Rhea is just making an example. Ragdolling Liv at ringside, casually making her way back into the ring. It's a picnic on Sunday afternoon. And now into the cover once more. Rhea to retain the championship. Liv is still into this. She cannot discount the heart of Liv Morgan. She has scratched and clawed her way back to number one contendership. Victories over Blair Davenport, Tiffany Stratton. She has gone to war, win, lose, or draw with Asuka and Shayna Baszler, Becky Lynch over the last year. Can she keep down Rhea tonight? Now you gotta pull the hair a little bit, take her down to the canvas, do what you gotta do. Here comes Liv, house of fire this time, trying to take down the nightmare of the Judgment Day. Starting to build some momentum. Can she capitalize on it? Goes for the kick. And Rhea Ripley closing the window on that opportunity. And Liv was going for that tilt to whirl again. Rhea nowhere to be found. And a big time German suplex takes down the challenger. Just like that, Liv Morgan's momentum squandered in a matter of moments by the champion. Rhea Ripley hell bent on domination tonight in Las Vegas. Back into the cover to retain the title and Liv. Some great ring awareness that time, only using enough energy that she has to extend to reach out and grab the ropes. I don't know what it's gonna take. I mean, Liv Morgan obviously did her homework on Rhea Ripley, but at the end of the day, when you're in the ring with somebody who is as physically dominating as the Nightmare, all bets are off, plans go out the window, and you are in for the fight of your life. That is why Rhea was Mrs. Money in the Bank. That is why she cashed in successfully, why she's defended it successfully ever since, and why she was recognized as the 2023 Women's Superstar of the Year. And back to the outside we go, and I do not think this is where Liv Morgan needs to be right now. Just trying to create some distance, get Rhea off her tail for a moment, but Rhea's having none of it. Again into the barricade. Oh, not, bam, ragdolling her. Liv is out. Her tank is running on E, and we are only a few minutes into this contest. A few minutes might feel like an eternity when you're in there with the Eradicator. Liv Morgan's tank clearly starting to run on E. Fatigue is dwindling, and Liv Morgan eats the canvas once more. Back into the cover we go. Live with a kick out, but how much is realistically left? Let me rephrase what I said moments ago. Endurance quickly dwindling in Liv Morgan and fatigue starting to set in. Back into the corner and Liv doesn't even have enough strength to keep her standing upright. Rhea Ripley, oh wait a minute, there you go. The challenger knocks the champion off her feet. Rhea's still swinging. What do you gotta do just to keep some damage on this woman? 
feels like a boss fight at the end of a difficulty video game for Liv Morgan tonight as she tries to rally. Las Vegas behind her, takes down the champion once more. Liv has not been on the receiving end of a lot of good grace in this match. She has been on the receiving end of a beatdown. Can she mount a comeback here and find the will within her to become the women's champion? Up into the ropes, Rhea Ripley might have her bell rung off that little bit of offense by the challenger. Liv's gotta keep the foot on the gas pedal to the best of her abilities. Obviously, it's gotta be hurt and it's gotta be feeling fatigue. But the former women's champion has fought long and hard to get this opportunity. Not looking to see it go to the wayside tonight. And a kick out only at one. Maria Ripley's got a lot left in the tank and that is not good for Liv Morgan who just gets absolutely slashed from behind with a mean lariat by the champion. And back into the corner again, and the story continues to repeat itself. Domination from the women's champion. Rhea Ripley is out to make a statement tonight. Out to prove her dominance. Why she sits at the top of the throne. Liv Morgan, no matter how much she tries to mount a comeback in this match, she just, she just cannot get some sustained momentum. There she goes again. She's trying to create that distance. Get herself in the driver's seat. Rhea Ripley with other plans. Rhea Ripley is coming in at the top of her game tonight. No doubt about it. Rhea's really starting to take the life out of this Las Vegas crowd with every shot to live Morgan. And as she soaks in the booze from T-Mobile Arena, I think it just fuels Rhea Ripley that much more to just continue this beatdown on the fan favorite and Liv Morgan. Kick to the gut. Oh, wait a minute. Down goes Liv with a rip tied. Into the cover. And that's it. That is it. Rhea Ripley just made the statement that she came to Sin City to make. Liv Morgan scratched and clawed to become the number one contender. It did not matter to the nightmare here tonight. Here is your winner, and still WWE Women's Champion, Rhea Ripley. That was one of the most lopsided performances I have ever seen inside of the squared circle. Rhea Ripley, pure domination here at the Rumble. The eradicator of the Judgment Day keeps the championship over her shoulder. Another victory for the ever-dominating 2023 Women's Superstar of the Year, Rhea Ripley. Face on when I chase like that, yeah, I play so strong with a knife in the back. I'm a swing home run like a baseball bat. Gonna see me rise if you hate on that. I don't play both sides, doing me no cap. I'm a rock.